So in the film, one of Jason's best friends, Jeff Easterwood, passed away when he was 15 years old by getting hit by a car. And Alex and I were trying to think of the best way to show that. And we thought that showing it from his perspective would be very, very powerful and really hit the audience in the gut, you know, the way that Jason and Jeff's family felt, you know, the day that Jeff had passed. So how do we do it in first person? First thing we did is we filmed a car idling toward a camera on a tripod. The car was only going five miles an hour, so we knew to have the car going 50 miles an hour, we'd have to speed the footage up 10 times. Then we did a little bit of masking to cut out the background, and we had our car coming toward the camera. Next thing we did is we went out on location to the Anthony Wayne Trail where Jeff passed, and I got the shot from Jeff's perspective walking out into the street, obviously with no cars coming. We went frame by frame, and we put the shot A of the car into shot B of Jeff's point of view to really make it languid and really make it believable. So then the last element that we added was the hands. So I took a picture of my hands, I cut them out with the mask, and then we animated it in a realistic motion. We put some realistic motion blur on it and then put all three elements together and that is the final composite in the film and that's how we pulled it off.